Great here. Welcome back to Tome with Jeremy. Uh, Jeremy 2.0, I guess, because we are... <laughs> we died the last time. Darn it. Anyway, we're on the third level of the Norgus Lair, so let's just get right into it. Uh, right. We are... Please don't... <sighs> well, uh, that escort sucked. Oh, now I get the, uh, the clock. I wonder if that would have uh, damaged my escort and killed it. Not sure. So, let's keep going. And... All basic stuff. We've seen this before with the... The first Jeremy. I can actually rush him. Actually, is he in maimed? No, he's just a rogue. And he's got regeneration on him, so... Hmm. Well. Two can play that game. There we go. Z doesn't uh, doesn't play nice with poisons or any damage over time. Oh, and there's <laughs> we would have had to get the uh, the escort that far. That would have been fun. Um, thank you. Okay, I think we had decided that odd levels would be cunning, even levels would be strength. There we go. Uh, do I want more into the Aegis? Hmm. I am noticing that I'm having a problem. Since my, my proc is uh, <laughs> uses up my mana, my health, my healing also uses mana. Not the best planning. So instead of pushing this up further to get a higher, uh, higher proc rate, Let's see. No, I don't want to push that one up. I definitely want to do more damage when it does proc. That would help. And let's see. This is a passive. Not worried about it. Clairvoyance. Um, which requires mana, unfortunately. So let's uh, do another into Aegis. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Me or snake. There we go. Yep, see that poison. I think that's what I'm gonna do now is actually get the the lightning up higher. And there's the frickin' bear. Well, we're not at full health. What poisoned me? What the... Well... Let's take what we learned. And instead of increasing the proc rate, let's actually increase the damage for when it does proc. Let's, let's try that route. Jeez. Oh, First things first, let's get all these back onto no we're not visible. There we go. Okay. Let's get them all activated since I have time to do so. Oh, uh, let's get back in here. Um, get my regen going. Um, no, there we go. Three. Oh, that helped immensely. Okay, Savior's Copper Ring. 
I will take anything I can get at this point. Hmm. Let's see. It gives us physical saves. Spell. It's just saves. It's better than nothing, though. Now, here's the question. I've got this... No, go away. Uh, let's exit out of that. Uh, infusion Wild. Activate the infusion to cure yourself of one random physical effect and reduce all damage taken for four turns. Okay. But I don't use it all that often. Hmm. I, I mean, I have this one, which is instant, doesn't do mana, it reduces damage, which is the main the main thing that I would use this one for. Um, maybe what I should do is, instead of transmorgifying my healing, I will put it in place of the, uh, of the wild. That way I've got double heals now, and one is not mana dependent. That will work. And can I set this to be... Hmm. I wish there was a way that I could, uh, well, maybe, maybe in here there's a different way. What I'm thinking is uh, there might be an automatic way that I could tell that that was not not funny. Okay, infusion, no, wrath of the woods, no, 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 cooling down talents. There we go, mana surge. Yeah, no, it's all the same things. What I was thinking was uh, there would be a way to have that auto fire when my mana is low. I mean, they've got other things that auto fire. Why not that condition? Seems reasonable, but apparently it's not. There we go. Let's charge in. Let's grab that. Film Totem of Cure Ailments. I'm not worried about these at all. I'm not going to go below weather. Let's see. Remove one poisons or disease. Putting all charms, well, better than nothing at the moment. I can't charge. So let's wait for them to filter in. There we go. Okay, that was bad. But it worked out. <laughs> I keep missing on that proc. Oh, come on. There we go. Playing copper ring, playing copper amulet. Okay, I know it's a plain iron mace, but is it? No, it does less damage than my uh, my long sword, so I'm not gonna take it. There we go. To the south is poison ivy. Let's get into a hallway. Get regen up. There we go. Actually, what I should have done is also the uh, the Wrath of the Woods. I don't use that all that often. Hmm. And what I should do, actually, is... I ought to use when uh, visible and adjacent. Yes. Close. And this is instantaneous. Okay. Push into him. Good, good, good. Okay, level two. Cunning. Constitution and magic. Okay, normally I would push this up, but I'm not going to. Uh, let's see. Let's definitely get another into here since this is activated, which reduces the cooldown. Let's start pushing this a bit more. Wait, no. Get the uh, the stronger armor. Can I hold this? You know what? I, I think I'm not going to spend it. I'm going to keep it. I think I can do that. Oh, that was nice. Okay. Anything here I want to keep? Absolutely not. So let us proceed to the next level. Okay. Rough leather boots. Better than nothing. There we go. B 
because of that fox down there, I'm going to back off. Get them to line up. There. That's what I was hoping for. Okay. Um. There we go. That lightning is so nice when it actually fires. What is this? Anti-magic. Do not want to step into that aura. There we go. Oh, come on. There. One more. Uh, snake to the south. Let's back off a bit. There we go. Definitely need to, to get in the habit of fighting in corridors. Whenever possible. There. Purge that poison off of me. Which is a good idea. Get the regen up. No, heal. There we go. Jeez. More snicks. More foxes. I think maybe having that, uh, having Wrath of the Woods on, ooh, oh, you didn't see that, damn it, that was dumb of me, yes, lead on, I will protect you, I hit escape to go out of the dialogue, which actually sells everything, that was just completely stupid. There's a better, uh, better sword in there, which is not good. Are you flipping kidding me? Okay. Got the regen going. Okay, I can't heal because because of the mana. No, no, because he knocked me upside my head. My head. That's why. Which is good to have the other one. Okay. Going a bit slow so I don't kill myself like I always do. Oh, come on. Okay. Yeah. Uh, sorry, dude. You're dead. <laughs> I'm sacrificing you so I may live. Yeah, I know. Quest failed. Okay, charge into him. Get a free attack. Come on. Okay. Heal up. Three more turns and I can do a Mana Surge. Which will let me use my other heal if I need it. Unless he does that to me. Uh, regen. Mana Surge. Heal. Oh. Saved my butt. Come on. Are you kidding me? Heal. And charge in. No, I can't charge into him. Let him advance. He is so much easier when you get to level 3. Thank you. And you also don't... Uh, 
give up your weapons. Or transmogrify your weapons on a level change. Why is this snake being annoying? There we go. Cloud color, armor. Well, I don't have a hat. I'll wield it, whatever it is. When in robe of nature, do not care. Okay. Cloud collar lets me have a ranged lightning attack. Range of 10. So, it's basically more lightning. And it will increase both of my mind power, which I do not have. I'm actually going to move this over to here because it's more defensive. And then move Cloud Collar in there over with my offense. Let's explore the rest of this level. Fight in the corridor. That is nice. There we go. Another snick. Okay, use cloud, cloud color whenever possible. Let's see if I can get them lined up. Okay. That was nice. Okay. Therefore, their gloves of magic gives me one armor plus two magic. Very nice. And also plus four percent on arcane damage. Go. It is to the north. Another to the north. That one I can charge though. Hmm. Not good. Better. Doubly better. Iron Great Sword. Is it better than mine? Yes, it is. Not as good as the Iron Great Sword of Acid that I sold or, or transmogrified. There we go. Huh, this entire time I hadn't leveled. Okay, let's get another into air. Let's get, let's see, I can go into, well, no, I only won one point there, so another into Earth for the bonus armor. Let's uh, get these taken care of before, uh, so I can see exactly where I am. I can go another point into air, very nice. I've got two generic points. Uh, 146 health. Well, definitely... Let's just get that cooldown as far down as possible. What does this go off of? Hmm. Oh, I got one more class point. I really don't want this to proc anymore right now. So I'm just going to leave that B. There we go. North is a green mass. Let's bring them down here. Nope, nope. There. That's when I wanted to do that. There. I don't believe I have a cloak, so let's get that worn. Balanced Iron Mace, which is... Crafted by a master, requires strength 11. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Balanced Iron Mace. Uh, it's not two-handed. Physical crit chance. Accuracy, defense, disarm immunity. Mm. 
that I'll keep it get this off of my hot bar there <laughs> oh we would have had to go all the way over here brass lantern of clarity which does what stealth invisible mental save and more light radius okay well we're done with this what is yes I know there's no place left to explore let's see I've got 28 gold let's see if I can find something worth picking up here in town actually I have a little bit more than 28 gold because I have not transmogrified all these yet Another thing I could do is I could uh, switch over to sword and board instead of saying on, on the two-handed. That would give me more defense. Uh, it would lower the proc chance. So it lowers my damage. But at least... But that's what I want. I want a lower proc chance. So Cleansing weather belt. Arcane disrupting forces. Not good. Grounding. Uh, wife regen is nice. Transcendence, physical save, or for the belt of the giants. I've got 56 gold. Well, you know what? I don't have a belt, and having more life regen would actually be very nice. So let's get that on. Uh, let's see. Nothing here that I can purchase because I'm down to 29 gold. What's in here? Def oh, wait, no. Infusions. Infusions are good. Healing infusion of the Titan, which is 29 gold, which I do not have. Well, I have 29 to 1, it's 29.36, so there's nothing here that I could purchase. Okay. Nothing there that I want. No. And. Yeah. Nothing there. But. No. Don't want to look in there. Great Mall. Anything here that I could afford? Nope. And there's nothing over there as well. Well. That was just not good of me that I, uh, oops, okay, there's nothing else that I want to transmogrify. Wasn't good that I sold all that stuff. Let's go into the next level. And this is where I'm going to put in a cut. At least I survived the initial area again. This is the third incarnation of Jeremy. I might go one or two more. We'll see how it goes. Uh, I, like I said, we're learning as we go. We're switching up our tactics, and maybe that's a bit more interesting than just restarting new characters every time. Let me know, and until next time, have fun.